Welcome to the Food Lab with Henry and Max. I'm Henry. I'm Max. First up is these... Mini Capolico. They're um, a type of freeze-dried ice cream things, but like they're not fully freeze-dried. So, so it looks like we have vanilla and... There's vanilla, um, strawberry, and chocolate. chocolate. So I think I'm gonna go for the chocolate. The chocolate's really good, actually. It's, it's nice and light. Yeah, same as the vanilla. What would you rate this? Um, probably a 7 out of 10. 7 out of 10? Yeah. I'd probably rate this maybe an 8. Okay, here we have Garada. It seems to be nori seaweed flaked peanut butter puffs. They look like cheese sure. ball puffs. Or cheese ball puffs, I'm not sure. It smells so like, um, like, it smells like fishy. seaweed a little bit. It smells, yes, like it smells seaweed. smells straight out of the ocean. That's what it smells like. It has a little bit of smell of salt. So I'm gonna... It's like very, it's sweet. Kind of with um, like a better aftertaste than like the just starting off. I don't know. I'd give it like a, I'd rate it like a five maybe. I'd give it like a eight or nine. It's just the fish, the yeah. fish taste is so yeah, strong. Yeah, that's really yeah, that's no one of the problems. Yeah. So let's see what's up next. Um, GCE wheat crackers, original flavor. Oh, holding with a whole fork. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. And let's, let's crack into this. So right off the bat, it smells like, um, it just smells like barbecue uh, chips. It's like the um, noodles that you get um, at these Asian restaurants as like a lo mein. star snack. Lo mein? I'm like not sure. It looks like dry lo mein maybe. Yeah, it's like a noodle, but um, Ooh. They're pretty good, but um, they kind of have an artificial flavor to them a little bit. I'd rate it like maybe a nine, maybe yeah, eight I'd and give, a half. Yeah, I'd give it an 8.5. I could snack on this for a while. As you can see, there is a variety of Asian s flavors that we have on this table. And overall, they were all very good and they were individual in their own tastes. But um, I hope we have influenced you to go to your local Asian market and pick some of these flavors out, these unique flavors, as they are not in most supermarkets that are widely available to us. I'm Henry. And I'm Matt. And we'll see you next time on, on Snack, Snack Time. time.